Brooklyn Independent Television. Brooklynites finally got some great transit news. After countless months of petitioning and fighting, the MTA will be restoring bus services throughout several neighborhoods in the borough and postponing fare hikes until March of 2013. And perhaps most exciting is news that the Brooklyn local is staying on track. Melissa Rose Cooper has more. G-Train commuters are breathing a sigh of relief after the MTA announced the temporary extension to its route will be permanent. So they're keeping it here. You don't have to worry about that. How does that make you feel? Good, good. <laughs> relieved. I feel much relieved. Uh, I'm, good. I'm really happy about that. The MTA added five stops to the G-Line in 2009 because of a $257.5 million renovation project at the Smith 9th Street Station. Since the project prevented trains from switching directions there, the line continued to Church Avenue, giving riders more access in Windsor Terrace, Park Slope, and Kensington. There's always room for improvements, but I'm satisfied with it. With the service that I'm getting now, you know, it's good. As the end of the renovations drew closer, there were talks of discontinuing the extension. But Brooklynites fought back, creating a number of petitions to save the extension, including the Five Stop Fan Club, led by public advocate Bill de Blasio. This is an opportunity for subway riders, business customers, and the businesses themselves to all work together to convince the MTA that these stops are crucial and they need to be saved. Now that the G-Line extension isn't going anywhere, strap hangers don't have to worry about how to get from Smith and 9th Street all the way to Church Avenue. The news of the permanent extension is one less concern for Brooklynites who are already dealing with multiple transit issues as a result of the new Barclays Center. This is important because it's by the city and I get on and off the stop all the time. Any expansion to the MTA is good. There are some writers who say saving the extension won't affect them at all. I don't really care. Because I work at a, a Fourth Avenue, uh, Second Avenue. I can take the G or the F, whatever. It doesn't matter. But many writers say they don't know what they would do if the stops were no longer around. It'd be rough because uh, my girlfriend lives here, so I would have to take the R, and the R is really slow, so be very inconvenient so it's good. I'd be really upset because <laughs> I take it every day so I think it's really great that it stops here at 4th Avenue. I get off right here, I go to work, I can get back on it, I get off at of Clinton, Washington. So it works really well for me. For Brooklyn Review, I'm Melissa Rose Cooper. Watch this and other Brooklyn Independent Television episodes online at brickartsmedia.org slash BIT.